The news division in, as a whole, so that includes writers, editors, photographers, and graphics artists, has about 140 people on it. Even though it seems like it's just something that you read, it's not. It's to us, it's, it's, a, it's our baby, you know? It's something that we work on really hard, so we really appreciate it when people pick it up and read it. I think the Collegian is successful because it has a lot of passionate students and has a good advisory base to give them feedback and to coach them through some struggles they may face. So earlier we were in our Board of Opinion meeting. Um, that happens either two or three times a week. Um, and what we do is we get together with our Board of Opinion, which consists of many of our editors, and we get together and talk about some topics that are going on in the world right now, or mostly in the Penn State community. It's doing the real thing. It's not something that, you know, you're doing it for a class and just one person sees it. The public gets to read what you write. Not only good writers, but, uh, you know, we're dedicated to what we, you know, what we do. Um, we're motivated. It's a lot of dedication. It's a lot of time. The copy desk people do a great job of trying to work in as many stories as they can before the deadline at one o'clock. And sometimes they have to they have to hold the deadline, they, have to, they don't make deadline, but it's definitely like a big time commitment. Check your sources, check your facts, make sure they're credible and make sure you tell them everything you need to know because you don't want to surprise them. I need people to know that we're not robots and we're not like scary, mean journalists that just want to like ruin people's lives that sit in a basement all day. Um, we really are an organization of people that just want to bring news to the community. And that's always our goal.